Okay guys, I'm going to the Arcane Secret Cinema event in LA in a couple weeks. And I'm going down with uh, Wonder Mellow, Katie, from our social team. We're gonna try and make some content and stuff and do, do these vlogs. But we decided we wanted to do a little bit of cosplay. And we might be doing some, you know, some, some major characters, having a little bit of fun with it. And me, being extra as all hell, have decided I'm going to go dye my hair instead of just wearing a wig. So, I'm gonna go do that. I'll see y'all on the other side. And there we go, there's the big reveal. My stylist is an absolute magician when it comes to colors, and my hair will never actually look this good because I can't style it at all. I'm excited for the costumes, excited to get out to LA for this event. And uh, damn, I am actually high on this uh, hair color right now. I'm, I'm feeling it. We'll be sticking around with this uh, magenta for a bit, I think. <laughs> Are you feeling ready to rumble, Casa? Rumble, rumble, rumble! <laughs> I'm just slamming onto this. <laughs> Hi. Oh no. So, Casa, how are you feeling right now? I feel good. I decide, we decided to get on this thing that goes really high when we both hate heights, so it's really, um, it's dope. It's dope. What are you most excited for? at Secret Cinema tomorrow, since we're just vibing on this Ferris wheel that's not moving. Yeah, not in the air, totally not crazy. Just shaking back and forth. <laughs> just answer the question, Katie. <laughs> answer the question. I can't wait to see the character actors. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine we're going to the uh, the Secret Cinema event. What are you most excited for, like going into something like this? How are you feeling? Uh, honestly, I'm most excited just to like hang out with a bunch of other people in like the community. Uh, Runeterra hasn't had anything like that yet. This is kind of the first thing for me. So yeah, really excited about that part. Hell yeah, dude! Excited to get in there with you. at the Secret Cinema, but they're gonna take our phones. So we'll get all the reactions and stuff about what was in there when we come out. But unfortunately, y'all don't get to see any of this. I just got out, you finished talking to Majin, and now I got Charmer and his wife Sophie here. We came out of the Secret Cinema together. I mean, Charmer, what was your favorite part of this, this entire experience? For me personally, my favorite part is the fact that I am normally, and I know this is going to be hard to believe because I do the casting stuff, but I'm normally a giant introvert, and she does all my talking for me, and then we got inside, and she claimed
slammed up, and then I <laughs> yeah, I, I got to like, spend charm yeah. twenty <laughs> years of like D and D experience playing in a basement. Came out and it was uh, wonderful and beautiful, and so I got to uh, plant evidence on somebody, <laughs> uh, which was wonderful. And we, we played got... like ten different storylines. Yeah, it was incredible. All right, awesome. All right, so I was just talking to Charmer and Sophie, and we saw it two seconds ago, but they kicked us out, so I didn't get to really fully hear from Sophie about her favorite part of the Secret Cinema. So just like walk me through, what, what did you really like about it? Um, I mean, where to start, but everything, the the storylines that you get captured into, like you start one story and then they grab you into another storyline so that you have to follow that and the way they immersed you into each like personal story really made it that much more enjoyable. It was sad that it, we didn't get our drinks and specials and stuff, but it worked out because that experience was definitely something different that we wouldn't have gotten anywhere else. That's it really made it fun and enjoyable because you felt like you were in that world and in that environment and running the the lines and everything else with the characters and stuff. So I think that was the part that really... back from LA. It was so amazing. Got to see so many cool people from Lore and Riot and a bunch of cool things just around LA and amazing, amazing food, I will say. The actual event was really cool from start to finish. I love how immersive everything was. It's even when you're just like getting your bag check and it probably my favorite thing about it was just all the little details that went into it like between the last drop and the character actors and I just remember seeing a bunch of the details on the set in like Cinch Lab or on the office from Silco and it was really really cool just seeing like a universe and all these characters that I've loved for years being able to finally be experienced by so many other people in such an intimate way in real life and i just thought that was so cool and they the, it was uh, a great location um and everything just worked out so last night while we were in rushed out from the secret cinema event when it ended i didn't really get a chance to talk to you guys about my experience and how much like i enjoyed it and it was really just this spectacular kind of unique experience that I've never had in any other way to go through and, and see these character actors that were doing such a fantastic job being true uh, to the show and, and having there be so many different possibilities for what you can do. I mean, last night when it would have been first impressions, I would have immediately thought like, my favorite thing was just the character actors being just so incredibly good and so incredibly gifted and so close to the source material. But the more I think about it over the last couple of hours and uh, before recording this is just the fact that you could probably go back that secret cinema event like 10 times and not experience all of the content that is possible within it is so incredibly cool because each person that goes into this place has a unique experience from everybody else and i think at the end of the day that is what made it so spectacular and i, I just hope that there's more events like this for things like Arcane or, or other games even in the future. I think that this is just such a cool format for kind of activating on these games and fandoms that we absolutely love. So it was a wonderful experience. We got to have a great dinner with a lot of uh, amazing people from the lore community afterwards. And I mean, I'm just grateful that I had the opportunity to come out here and do this. So shout outs to the LPP and shout outs to Wisdom for, for making this all happen. Mm -hmm.